And uh, if you haven't bought tickets to that yet, you should. That's that's going to be a good one. I don't know if it's going to be here, but it's somewhere. It is. Yeah, it's right here. Here. Okay. Is that me rumbling? Uh oh. You think my battery's dead? You got your cotton? Okay, he's gonna run tail what? run tail that, homeboy. You mean he's already got his cotton? Uh he don't have his cotton yet. Yeah, he's got it. He's done got it. Yeah, he's he he picked it up. I, I, I set him up with Gary, you know. I I knew Gary in college and I took him down there and was like, Hey man, you wanna you wanna go get this uh, you know, wow. guitar and he I took him down there and he's like, Yeah, I'll buy one, what the heck? So now uh so now every time he's around, I get to I get to play it. And I I told him I'd play it tonight, and then I just went and grabbed mine because I like my pick. Like I said, I got this poker chip here. Uh, I guess now'd be as good a time as any to tell you that I don't only uh, cut hair and sing songs. I'm also a host on the radio. I host uh, the Little Egypt Saturday Showcase on 97.3 WRUL Carmi, the Tri-State Boomer. Uh, and you can find that on WRUL.com. Saturday mornings at 10 a.m. Um, Featured many great artists, some of the likes, uh, like Brother Smith, the local yeah. honeys. Uh, yeah. We've had uh, Don Rogers' songs yeah. have been on there a time or two. Yeah. We've uh, we played a little Arlo McKinley, a little John R. Miller. Uh, Jen Tackett's been on there. Madden, Madeline Goins, Jordan Lee King. Everybody. Uh, Hunter Flynn, Ethan Wayne, all of them. I play them all. If they're my friend and, and they live around here, I, I play their music. So that airs uh, Saturday mornings at 10 a.m. on WRUL.com. And uh, my guitar's not here yet, so... Or wait, is that it? That's it right there. Okay. I can be funny for a few more seconds. Uh, yeah. 97.3 FM, WRUL. Cotton guitar. Cotton guitar, okay. Brand new. Bring it out. Play it, baby. Play it. Yeah, I sure will, babe. Whatever you want. This one's much lighter. All right, now let's, All right. let's hear it. Oh, yeah, that's a, okay. We better play a bluegrass song. All right, that was it. <laughs> um, <laughs> well, you were going there, didn't you quit? <laughs> I wrote this song about my hometown a couple years ago when gas prices were really low and uh, life was good. And uh, but our town was really corrupt and there's there was just like some really crazy stuff going on politically. I don't really get into politics uh, except for small town politics because I live there. And so I wrote this song as a you know in my best uh, Bob Dylan form, I guess. You know how he wrote those protest songs, but mine's not nearly as. <laughs> protestful it's just more about like staying in the small town don't leave the small town you know you, you got to live that small town life yeah the big cities are nice you got taco trucks till four in the morning but you know who doesn't like their gas station closing at nine o'clock at night come on so this song's called whateverville Is that loud? I don't hear it, nothing. No. No. Well, back behind the ball field where the water backs up deep. I'm still alive past 25 and drive the same damn streets. There ain't much to do in this old pit since Patiki up and closed. We're a broken alliance, cast away by coal. The roughnecks got it rougher with the price per barrel down. You don't see them out-of-state drillers rolling through the town. There's young folks leaving state. Now the old folks die alone and those of us who stay we're barely hanging on 
well living here can make you nervous there's no ambulance service but that mayor makes double he don't care if we fall ill and all them friendly faces grab their boots and suitcases and start running out of town running out of town oh they leave right out of town for whateverville Meth heads maneuver mowers from point A to point B. We got mamas on mountain bikes with babies on their knees. Squatters north of Shipley Street, they scavenge to survive. They're steady selling food stamps. That's the cost of living high. While rich folks in the country in their million dollar homes, they go weekend on the water in their million dollar boats. Well, somewhere in the spectrum, from sea to jealousy, the poor folks go to rich folks' homes and they don't need no key. Well, living here can make you nervous. There ain't no ambulance service, but that mayor makes double. He don't care and we fall ill. And all them friendly faces grab their boots and suitcases and start running out of town. Running out of town, oh, they leave right out of town. 